really difficult character to play against if you do not know what she's capable of. Yeah. Jesus, like, so much trickery, so much, like, adjustments need to be made in her play style. And versus a character like Paul Rong, who has a pretty high skill for Yep. In my career, so. All right, let's see what happens. Ooh, Shaman had it, had it the gate get aggressive. Grab. Grab. Yeah, was, Into the wall. Really good job keeping him in. That was... Yeah, that was Sandman clean, clean with it. Two. Fight. Does the power crush? It grabs. An interesting choice to not keep uh, Lope Xavier on the wall. Yeah. Picks him back up, though, and he's going to take him right back, so it's okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. The power crush is coming out. That string's tough, but it is interruptible. Uh, the last hit is real slow. Fight. So it's not a frame trap, then. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you should be able to. Uh, you should be able to interrupt it with a jab. Right. Unless that's another string I'm thinking of, because a lot of H1 strings can look the same. <laughs> yeah, so Sandman's not really playing around. Right? He, he, he wants to finish oh this my quickly. god, he wants oh to be in goodness. and out. Yeah. For game one. Three clean. Wow. Sandman not messing around. Yeah, actual first stage change. Ooh, the new the oh, Howard the Estate. Those those like full those full health combos you can do yeah. <laughs> if you have full ra rage and like meter and everything. This Crazy. is a thin stage too, so you can get your opponent to fall rage. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. That one red stripe in Ace Wong's hair. All I want from Sandman, if he wins, not saying the whole sport, but if he wins, I want the victory animation where he just gets on his bike and looks back all <laughs> angry. It's so silly. Yeah. One wall break, there we go. Oh, nice duck. Into the wall. There's the other wall. Kicks him. No tail spin. There's one. And that's it. Oh, that was not it. Not giving them any room to breathe. Yeah, the power crush game is ridiculous on H1. I like stages like this because they get bigger and bigger and bigger the more walls you break. Yeah. So it's like it, it gets less and less dangerous. Ah, the grab, oh, oh, no breaks. Grab. Those, I think those are, I think those are just standard grabs too. I, he can tech those with one or two. I don't even think those are commands. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that was two and four grab. Yeah. So these, these are just, these are just standard grabs right now. He's got to tech those. Yeah. Such tricky mix-ups. The thing about H Wong though is that stepping, uh, uh, stepping right against him is, it's, it's very strong. Um, you can sidestep most of his stuff uh, when he's in stance. So, but man, he's just uh, Lord Xavier's just not making a lot of adjustments right now, and it's costing him. Sandman's just walking backwards, not even back dashing. Hits him with the uh, the tailspin there, takes him to the wall. Back against the wall, though, scary stuff. He just keeps trying to do that that one plus two there. Is that overhead. One yeah, it is breakable. Yeah. Into the wall, KO. All right, round five, game two. Let's see what Lord Xavier can pull together here. Yeah, Lord X is having a difficult time adapting. Right now. Wall break. Oh, nothing off the the break. Okay, Sandman goes down the crumble there. Oh, there's the skyrocket. Oh, no. That might be a dead Oh, demon. the wall saved him there, but no. Oh, that's a dead demon. Just a grab. Sandman's going to take a 2 oh, over UGS Lord and Savior. Man. Uh, it, it, it's, it's the there angry. it is. Yeah, there's, there's the <laughs> angry screen. It's so silly. Yeah. H1's got some funny, like, stage entries, exits, and stuff.